first of all, of all, of all, of all, just to get to this update, I had to complete the whole game, defeat the last boss. This is probably the most work I've put into the update video ever. Essentially what's new is this Grenadier class though. It's not really clear to me what it changes, just like any other class. I wish there would be more explanation order than, you know, medical expert. Like, on the first glance it's nothing, but like I experienced. You get more HP, more frequently the health mods drop. So that's a note to developer, just more transparency what's going on. What we're gonna do is lunatic mode today, which I honestly have no idea what's gonna be happening with this. We'll see with the gameplay. Okay, we start the same with two pistols. I mean, it's not like they are hard to get. Like the second one you basically have after the first encounter. <laughs> Ah, back to the mines. Oh, oh! The endgame characters are here. Okay, so that's just gonna be more chaos. <laughs> That's gonna be interesting. The patch notes kinda said it's gonna be more challenging, which... I mean, if I have characters from the last level here... I can see how. <laughs> um, I'm not gonna play all the way. This is just to discover. I'm gonna do the playthrough actually of the whole game because I had to complete it in order to get this update. So why not just make more videos on it? What do we get though? Okay, that's gonna be fun. Oh shit. <laughs> That wall looks suspicious. Huh. So I really wonder what's gonna be like with the last boss or just any other area. <laughs> it kinda indicates there are new enemies, which there are. I mean, it's kinda a rest skin. Okay, the notes are the same. I didn't encounter an HP. <laughs> this is gonna be just nice to have one. Normal bullets, it's rockets. <laughs> I think I'm gonna play all the way mines. What the? <laughs> I heard you. <laughs> and that would be sufficient. Unless I will die, which is highly likely. <laughs> now I'm trained in the headshots. <laughs> I played this game so much. <laughs> I can't even tell you. Maybe 10 times to even complete the game. And I was doing it only with Sniper because I thought that's the way. But no, <laughs> Medic is the way. Being one-shotted at the last levels is not fun. You literally want to 
throw away your headset out the window. Which I nearly done. Yeah, this health station does nothing for them. <laughs> Oh my god, but move! <laughs> Even this has more HP. <laughs> oh, adrenaline. I'll show you. It's so funny. Well, I'll use one. Oh shit! <laughs> hey! No! Not dying now. Let's go. <laughs> now it exploded. <laughs> I feel like that's gonna be all to this mode though. In the mines at least. That amount of damage does nothing. I have to just do all the headshots from now on <laughs> to even survive. I can understand why Lunatic unlocks after you complete the game. You first have to understand the mechanics because you will die instantly. Shotgun helps you. Too bad they don't drop like good weapons. Accuracy already. It's no surprise I carry basic handguns, like... This is my weapon in every VR game. <laughs> what is here? A shield, eh? Huh? Uh. <laughs> nice dodge. <laughs> uh, I'll pass on the shield. I mean, actually, I have space. Sometimes in this game you have to go ham, not just stand in one place. <laughs> oh, 
Oof. <laughs> That's rough. Okay. Oh, they explode, I forgot. <laughs> I mean, that's essentially gonna be it. They kinda switch the enemies from the last levels to the first ones. It's like instantly more difficult because you don't have everything like upgrades and stuff. So I wonder in the later levels, huh? Maybe after the normal playthrough, I'll do the lunatic one. Then we'll see about that. The update is fun. Now that I understand the game and I know the mechanics and such, I know what works and not. And it's pretty fun, so looking forward to more.